I just want to warn people about taking this uh, Halong Bay cruises because uh, we was in Vietnam for 16 days and um, we ended up taking a flight from Da Nang to uh, Hanoi and then a two hour drive from Hanoi to Halong Bay to take this five stars uh, luxury cruise and this was the worst experience we had in all of Vietnam. We even got thrown out of coffee places because we were white and some other disappointments, some experiences was great as well. But this cruise really ruined the end of our trip. This was supposed to be a five stars uh, luxury cruise. It uh, cost a lot of money and the room was supposed, the boat was supposed to be uh, twice as big as it was. The room was supposed to be three times as big as there was. And they were dirty, really dirty. We had to clean our room ourselves. We even got to choose between two different rooms, but uh, the other room was just up above the engine and it smelled like fumes from the engine. So we couldn't use the balcony and we it made a lot of noise, so it's hard to sleep. It, it was awful. And uh, my girlfriend is allergic to seafood. I don't like seafood. And the only one on the only thing on the menu was seafood and usually squid because squid is the only thing left in the water because these boats make so much pollutions so you can't see more than a few centimeters uh, under the surface it looks green but if you drop a coin you don't see the the coin going down it's just and this was this island of pollutions with uh, plastic and garbage everywhere and the boats are just filling the water with oil and soap and everything. We could see it when we stood on the balcony and looked outside the boat. The, the, the soap and the oil was just coming out in buckets. So please do not ruin the environment even more. Yes, it was beautiful surroundings with the... Uh, cliffs coming out of the water and everything but I really advise everyone to don't take these cruises especially the Pegasus cruise because we were really hustled we were paying for like a week in a five-star uh, hotel in in Vietnam for this one day and one, actually it, it says two days and two days is less than 24 hours so two-day cruise lasted for 20 hours so I don't know how their days work but you're back here early in the morning uh, after a really petty breakfast with seafood of course and uh, even they told my girlfriend that it was without seafood and it was seafood so they could actually have killed her and only one person of the crew members spoke English bad English but um, so we were just kind of stuck in a filthy place with lots of Asians who seemed like they didn't appreciate us being on board really. So please 